Kentucky's sole abortion clinic is asking a federal appeals court to once again review the case of a state law that requires doctors to perform ultrasounds and describe results of the procedure to patients before an abortion. The challenge comes as thousands of protesters rally in response to recent restrictive abortion legislations passed across the country. LAX 18's Mike Valenti is live here in the studio. He has more now on this continuing coverage. Claire, Chris, good morning. Just last month, a divided panel of the six U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals upheld the 2017 law, reversing a lower court judge's ruling that it was unconstitutional. Now, attorneys for the ACLU representing the Louisville Clinic are asking the full appeals court to rehear the case. They filed a petition citing a First Amendment issue of exceptional importance. The law requires doctors to describe the ultrasound in detail while the pregnant woman listens to the fetal heartbeat. Kentucky is also one of several states to recently pass a so-called fetal heartbeat bill, banning abortions when a fetal heartbeat can be detected. That can be as early as six weeks, when, as critics point out, women may not even know they're pregnant. Abortion bans across the country, including the most stringent one recently passed in Alabama, sparked protests yesterday at the Supreme Court and nationwide. Hundreds of people are calling our health centers in Alabama, Georgia, Missouri, not sure if we're still open to provide care. We need them to know that these laws are not in effect yet, and Planned Parenthood will be fighting with everything that we have. Our doors are open. Pro-life activists also gather at state capitals across the country to voice their support for abortion restrictions. Meanwhile, this Saturday in Lexington, the Kentucky National Organization for Women will hold a protest called Convergence for Reproductive Rights. Claire, Chris, back to you.